Hello everyone, welcome back to World Builder with our second part um, with the three sisters. Um, so last time we met the three wonderful sisters. We've got Kelly, Natasha and Sophie. Oh, nearly forgot, but that's okay. Um, and I have started building their house. So it's three sort of main stories and then we've got this extra little room in here. So that's sort of where we got to. Um, the only things I've really changed or fixed up was the roof here. Um, you see how it sort of overlaps there? It was really glitchy so I managed to line that up so it's alright. Um, I know there's that weird bit there but honestly I think it's okay. I think it'll be fine. <laughs> Um, so today I thought I would put the windows on and the wall covering and just a little bit of sort of um, brick on the ground and then maybe we will go into our hallway and maybe start the living room but we'll just see how far we get. Oh the mailbox is up there. I'll just put that down here. So yeah I think the first thing I'm going to do is the uh, colouring of the house. So one thing that kept popping up when I was researching was sort of like a sagey green colour. Oh that could be nice. I, I kind of like that. I don't know whether I want to go for smaller panelling or bigger panelling. Oh that's white, hold on. Mm, I quite like that actually with like the trim. But I've also got some really cool custom content. I'll show you now. Where is it? I think it's in wall decorations. Yes, these. So you can put these on the walls, which is really cool. So I kind of want to use those as well. I don't know if it will make sense, but I think it'll look quite nice. So maybe I'll do that. Um, mm, what do we prefer? I like that colour, but I like the star. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I don't know. Let's go for this darker one first, I think. I feel like that's quite cool. Although the side's really glitchy. Um, yeah, let's go for this. I think initially I was thinking a slightly lighter green, but that actually is okay. So I'm gonna just. Zoop. Zoop. that on there. I've probably missed, oh yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, missed the entire back bit. Oh now you might see I've popped a little, a couple windows on. So that was just me sort of trying to figure out and I think these are the best, the best match we've got for a sort of Victorian style. So I'm going to put those on. Oh. Do I not have move objects on? Hold on. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I like I like how these look. I'm gonna have to just sort of adjust them a little bit. But that's oh yeah, that's cool. And then I want two on here. Is that the same height? Why what? I think. Oh, why can't I tell? Oh, I see. Okay, if that goes just slightly further forward, that would be that would be nice. Um, I might move that like that. Beautiful. And then one more here. Now I've sort of decided what to do with the little extra room here because we've got one of the bedrooms sort of attached in here to this other room, and I think I'm going to make it like a little lounge. Um, so when they get up in the morning, they can just kind of like go there, you know, um, I think that would be quite nice. So I'm just going to put some windows around. I will probably move these, won't I? Yes. <laughs> but I think just so we can get the idea of how they will go so that when I'm laying everything out, Oh, <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to alt place every single one apparently, that's fine. Um, 
oh yeah these are the little bathroom windows that's going to be in the kitchen anyway so that's kind of cool could keep those a little bit lower i need a door for there oh so oh i think we'll do the two here as well but just a little bit closer together obviously these are not perfect don't worry if it annoys you i understand because it annoys me but it's just so we can get the idea you know you know what i mean um oh and here we've got a little bay window i've got some really cool custom bay window seats that i'm going to put in so that'll be really nice that'll look so cool um how are you all i'm sure you're good you know it's just all good well we're still in lockdown so that's fun but um, we are good. We are good. It's my birthday tomorrow. Um, I don't know whether I should say how old I am. Oh, who cares? I don't really care. I will be 25. <laughs> that's not that bad, I suppose. Oh, that's her study, isn't it? I might put two windows like that. Weird. Oh, and the roof cutting in there. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I think for the little... Oh, yeah, that'll be nice. I'm just going to leave that bit because I'm not quite sure what to do about the windows there. Um, oh, but I would like to put these little windows. Oh, perfect. Just like that. I think that looks really cool. Now, for the roof... I do like that roof. That's just sort of the roof that it always starts on. But I'm wondering if we could do like... Uh, uh, <laughs> that is quite common. Um, I live in an area with a lot of Victorian era houses and they all sort of have that coloured roof. Well, a lot of them. So I'm not sure. Oh, that's nice. Oh, but they do look quite pink. Oh. You know, that's quite nice actually. I might just go for that because I, I sort of wanted it to be a little bit more orangey but I didn't want it to be like gross. <laughs> so let's do that. And for the trims, I haven't really decided. Oh, we could keep it really, oh, that's quite a big trim. Um, I don't know. Oh gosh. <laughs> so I've been, oh yeah, that's nice. I've been doing a lot of researching of Victorian styles and decor and everything. I, I sort of had a, a vague idea, but I'm sort of a bit more clued in now on their stylings and why certain things were certain ways, um, especially on the inside to do with like the kitchens and things. Um, but I'll sort of explain stuff once I'm decorating. Oh, we could do the little green door. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I think I like that. Um, so next, I'm going to do just some very, very basic. Um, oh, I love that. They said it's quite common to have, um, you know, bricks on the, on the actual terrace. So that's quite cool. I'm just sort of thinking, do I want to have brick stairs? I think I do. I don't know if I like the colouring though, because this stuff is very pinky. I don't know whether it's best. Oh! Ah, oh, wait, where did my. <laughs> oh no. Where did my beautiful brick go? There. Um, I'll do this little one too. Hmm, I'm not sure. Do you think that sort of works? I might I might do it for now and just see how I feel. Otherwise we'll go back to something a little bit more wooden. Oh! <laughs> I don't know what to do. Actually, I do prefer wood. Maybe we'll just do that. We'll do that for now. And I think around here I want to do 
bricks. But I don't like the big white trim, to be honest with you. Oh, oh I don't know about that either. What's that? Oh, that's metal. That's one of them sort of... I feel like that would be quite common. Oh, I don't like it. No, no, no. So this is where I'm sort of taking my um, artistic freedom. And I'm going to be changing stuff because I don't like how that looks. So yes, we are heavily inspired by the Victorian style, but certain bits are not going to be. I like that my house has a... Oh, it's changing the colour. Okay, fine, whatever. My house has a little deck like this with um, pretty much those exact poles. Like fence poles. So I think that that's, that works quite nicely. And I think... Oh, stop! I think around here I want to do the same. But I will just put it like that. And then I'll get those stairs. And, oh, does anyone else hate the controls? Yeah. Like that. And now I'm not sure about those railings. I think I need to do, um, have we got sort of more fine ones? Oh, those are oh, perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's cool. I like that. That's so cute. Okay, so that's all I'm going to do on the outside for now. And now we're going to do the hallway. So I think the windows sort of make sense like that. I'll just move that a little bit. I don't want that one there, I don't think. So something that's quite common in Victorian homes is tiles. Um, in the entranceway and things, or just generally. So I kind of want to go for, hmm, I'm not really sure. I was sort of thinking like a red, red and white type deal. But they were quite, um, like a bit chunkier. Oh, that's quite cool. Yeah, hold on, let's see, let's see. I don't think they'd necessarily do the terracotta. I'm sure they I'm sure they did, but Oh, I'm unsure. What about oh no. <laughs> I think my favourite one so far is probably that one actually. Um and we'll leave it there just for now until I decide whether I like them. Yeah, okay, we'll do that for now. It's not exactly what I had in mind. I had sort of a more, like, chunky sort of thing in mind. Sort of a bit bigger, but maybe not yellow. Um, but that's okay. That is alright. For now, I think that's quite cool. And for the walls? Now, for the walls, floral wallpapers were very common. So I've got these beautiful custom content ones. I don't think I'm going to use them in here, but oh my gosh, I'm going to use them in the bedrooms. So a lot of them are William Morris um, designed. So uh, this one, for example, I love that. That's so beautiful. So a lot of dark florals as well. Um, so I'm really, yeah, I'm excited to use those, but I think for in here, I'm just going to use something, just a bit of paint not quite sure I think actually I need to do one with a big trim on it because that was quite common um, to have a really nice big trim on your walls mmm I'm sort of liking that color like browns and grays and things are gonna be quite um, quite a feature in this house might just move that down yeah yeah cool oh that's actually really cute okay um should I turn the grid off yeah okay I'm gonna turn the grid off for doors for doors I just want a basic little pretty door 
think we'll do... Should I do sort of brown doors maybe? Yeah, I think I will. I quite like that. We'll do it like that. Yeah, that's cool. Cool. Although I could just do an archway into there. Oh, I'm not sure. It would let a bit of light in, which would be nice. Maybe I'll do that and... I could do an archway. Yeah, that's quite nice actually. A wooden archway. In that colour. Yeah, that's nice. I like it. <laughs> so as you can see, it is rather loosely <clears throat> inspired in, in some ways. Um, but it's, it's actually really nice having the freedom to just like decide. Oh, I do like the white railing in there, although that's going to be so annoying, that little bit up there. Whatever. I'm just going to deal with it. Um, yeah, I like, oh, <laughs> I like that. I think that's nice. And I'm going to put a little, a little table. I got a really cool um, custom desk as well so that's quite cool um so for surfaces yes i think i want one of these maybe i should put it right in the corner because otherwise you're not going to be able to get up those stairs are you oh no is that the one i wanted oh, i think i wanted that one actually that just felt a little bit more what i was going for Let's see, how close can I get that without it being annoying? Oh, <laughs> clearly not very. Hold on, I'm just going to put the grid on. So I actually can't have it very... Okay, <laughs> never mind. I'm going to use that somewhere else. In here, I'm going to just put a little table, I think. I do love that one as well. I'm definitely using that as well. Beautiful. Should I just put all the stuff I'm using out there? Maybe I'll just do a little table. That's kind of a bit weird, isn't it? That's okay. We're just we're just thinking. What if I do this? Oh, cute. Yeah, I want to do that there. <clears throat> I like having that there. That's pretty. We'll do... Actually, I want those colours because that reminds me of um, Madeline, you know, the, um, the movie and the, I think it was a book originally. Oh. <laughs> I'm just looking through all my custom content stuff. Oh, I like those cushions too. I might use those definitely. Um, hmm. Let's see. I'm going to leave that for now because I can't decide. <laughs> So in here, this is going to be quite cool. I have decided that I need a fireplace. I definitely need one. So I'm not sure whether I want to build it in or what. But for now, um, I'm just going to have a wee look, see. Because I don't know whether I want it to be one that they can use or whether I want it to just be like one with little candles, because I think that's quite nice. I do really like that one because it's not too bulky because like this one this one comes out a lot further so I can imagine them having something like that oh yeah that's cool now do I want those windows I'm just sort of rethinking everything because I want to do a feature wall here with a big mirror and some shelves let's take these out for now because I feel like we've got enough light from that now I'm just thinking this room's going to have the dark floral somewhere in it um, might just quickly get a, a light I always just use this one f at first so that I can sort of see what I'm doing <clears throat> um, but then sorry I'm just gonna grab a little sip of tea ah, gotta keep hydrated it's quite, I mean, I talk a lot, but <laughs> when you have to talk consistently, um, it's very tiring. It's just, what if I did a darker color? 
Oh, that's cool. Yeah, okay, okay. I'm inspired. So I really want to use, I have to use the trims again. Purple is quite a common color, actually. Oh, that would be really pretty. You know what? I'm going to use the purple. I think that looks really cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, let's, let's just go with that. And then I'm going to get some, I mean, I could do book, bookcases. They would have to be, oh, they re, they got more colors in these. I just remembered. <gasps> so cool. Um, anyway. Oh, that one would be perfect for another room. I might not use it in here, but that would be really cool. Um, do I want to go with my shelf ideas? I think I do. I think I want to do my shelf idea. What one do I want? That's quite nice. Uh, that's a bit more ornate. Do I want it to be like... Floating. Oh, I do like it kind of in the wall like that. Oh, that's a very wide shelf. Hmm. Got the sort of terrazzo pattern there. I could do a nice, a nice grayish shelf. That looks more gray. Okay, let's just try this. The thing is, you got, you've got to try just to see if it actually looks good. And if it looks shit, you can just take it away. So we'll do that. Do I want to put like a little bench underneath? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, one thing I really, really want is a beautiful big mirror. Quite often they had... It was either like just a square mirror or quite ornate so I think I want to go for something quite ornate in here but like wider rather than taller so that's that's not quite right oh that looks really good hold on <laughs> um, oh that's beautiful that's that's for another build that I want to do a sort of art deco build um, doesn't suit in here but um, Stay tuned. Oh, I love that. If I could just rotate that, that would be really nice. Thank you. What about, what about... Oh! <laughs> okay, not doing that. I think my favourite one is that... Uh... <laughs> this one looks really, like, scratched and... While I can appreciate the shabby chic design, I mean, I work in a shop that's very shabby chic, but I don't think they would necessarily love that. Maybe, um, maybe Sophie would, because she's into that sort of older thing, older style, but how are we feeling about these shelves? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Let's see, what else have we got? Oh, that's quite nice. It's just a little bit thinner. You know what, I'm going to change those out for the smaller one. Yeah, I like that. It doesn't look like we've got a grey, but that's actually alright, never mind. Uh, can I rotate that? I don't want that sticking out there. Oh, no I can't. Ah! What if we got... Oh, that's cool. What if we got that and put it like that? Oh, beautiful. Yeah, I quite like that. Might do it like that. Oh no! This is just, this is just evolving as I'm doing it, but I think that that looks really cool. I like how it sort of looks connected. It's not necessarily in line, but it looks a little bit more connected. So these are going to be for like, uh, 
books maybe but more just display displaying pretty things let's do that now actually what I want to do is find a wallpaper that fits in I don't think the wallpapers have no they don't they don't have the edge things but that's okay what if I do oh, I really love that one I think I'm going to go for that one okay it doesn't really fit in with the trims but that's okay I can do something there what if I did this what if I did no that's a bit much so we've got a feature wall there and then we've got this beautiful area here oh yeah I like that it's a bit weird but I'm sure I could figure something out I'll get like a trim or something and put it around the top I don't know maybe I can just sort of overlook that <clears throat> it looks fine like that I wish I could lift that a little bit higher I don't really like that sitting in there can I oh no 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 <laughs> never mind oh wait it did it it did do it it just flew the camera away <laughs> Oh, that's better. I think, do I want it to be darker now so it really stands out? Yes. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Maybe, I'm just thinking, should I do this? Uh, no. I sort of like it like that. I like it like that. Let's put some... Oh, are these the annoying shelves that don't let you put anything on them? Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Let's put a little... Um... Oh, I like that one. Let's put her there. And then let's get... Flowers. That looks nice, but I want... Oh, I don't want any of those colours. I wish they'd just have like plain ones that I could use. Ah, oh, let's have that in the grey. Now that is beautiful. For the floor, since I just realised I forgot to do that, we're going to put um, a wooden floor. I'm going to have a wooden, wooden floor running through the whole house. I'm thinking a dark wood. Ah, oh, yeah absolutely so that's going to be tiled I think maybe the kitchen will be tiled or the dining room but I think that's what we're going to do there now I want to put in the window seat which I'm really hoping it will fit otherwise I will cry uh, not that that here they are so please fit please fit oh perfect okay oh, that is exactly what I wanted oh my gosh that is perfect. I think now that I've gone for a dark grey, I will do the same there. And then you just get this little seat. So these are from Peacemaker. Um, and then you just put that on the top. Oh, so cute. I think, hmm. I like the colour, but I don't like the texture of that. I'm just trying to think what other colour could we put in here. That would be quite nice. I don't want it to be too bright or too modern. What about that green? Sort of loosely ties into the um, theme. Is it too wacky? Oh, what about that? <laughs> no. No, no, no. Okay. What about brown? I'm gonna leave that for now I think that looks quite good if I change my mind that's cool and I'm gonna just put these down I think it makes a little bit more sense with the wallpaper because you can imagine in real life that would be quite textured um so I think I want to put a really cool lamp in the corner have we got a lamp and there's one that I'm thinking of it's a custom content one oh yeah 
definitely. But do I want that? Oh, I want that colour. I might put this over here. Yes! <laughs> That's really cute. That's really cute. Okay, and now the... I'm just going to put the walls down so I can think about what I'm doing. Um, we're going to have a couch. I think I'm going to put this big couch in. I don't actually often use this couch, so I'm quite excited to actually have a chance to use it. Because my builds are not necessarily like something that would include a couch like this. And I think we will put it right against the wall just because it is quite a small room and I want to get, because obviously we've got the window seat, but I want to get like a, a little couple of chairs in here as well. So I think I'm going to do, oh, that's beautiful. Do I want to keep it, I mean I want to quit, like, I want to keep it quite neutral, but oh, I really like that one. I'm going to do that. This room is turning out quite dark, but that that is definitely what I want. I wish I could make the trims not white, but that doesn't really make sense because that's what they would have been. Um, oh, cool. Do I want to move this slightly so I can get a chair in there? Yeah. I could either do this one. Oh, no, I'm doing that. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say I could either do that or like a, a little seat, but I really want to use the set. So, absolutely. Where is the matching one? <laughs> Please tell me there's a matching one. I will cry. Is that the one? Am I going crazy? Is there not a matching one? <gasps> Stop it. Does that... Wait, what? <laughs> that one's got like a purpley tinge to it. That's why I liked it, but... Uh... <laughs> well, I guess I'm just going to do that. Oh, I don't know. I don't like that. I really don't like that they don't match. That makes me sad. That's okay. We'll just do that for now. Um, might even move that over a little bit more. Yeah, we could just swap that out for another seat, but that's okay. Um, and then I want to do uh, this beautiful little table. Is that the one? Yeah, that's the one. But in grey? Oh, that looks nice. Hold on. Let me just see. Oh, I, th I think I want this in here, actually. I think I want it to line up like that. Beautiful. But in perhaps that colour? Yeah, I don't want that really, really bright wood. Oh, I've got it there. <laughs> well, okay, we're going to tone that down a little bit. And then I think... I'm not happy with this colour. I think I'm going to do a green, <laughs> because why not? Um, and then on the table, I just want to have another little plant. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, but let's change this to that. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about those shelves there. That's very frustrating. What if I, what if I did swap those out for bookshelves? Let's see, it would have to be, oh, <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm going to think on that and I'm going to leave it there for today. Um, unless I just, I'll just put one little painting on the wall. <laughs> this is custom content. Um, it's very big. Oh, that's pretty. So these are all obviously real paintings. I like the pre-Raphaelite ones. I think a lot of these might be pre-Raphaelite. Where's the one I'm looking for? <laughs> so, oh yeah, that one. 
that's just beautiful I love that the colors in that are so pretty um, yeah I think I'm gonna leave that there for today uh, obviously it's a, just a very basic layout and things but that is coming together so nicely and I think that wallpaper really helps so oh we've got a tile out here goodbye so this is for these gals they will be moving in who knows when <laughs> But I think that looks really nice, and I can get a nice little screenshot of that for the, um, for the, what you call it, thumbnail. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks so much for watching, and stay tuned for part three, because I'll make it either tomorrow or the next day. Well, actually not tomorrow, because tomorrow's my birthday, although we'll see how I feel. Um, yeah, so I'll see you next time.